know me. I'm a huge fan of Pokemon and have been since I was like seven or eight years mm -hmm. old. And at the end of the day, there is one mascot for the brand. No matter how many times they try to replace or remove the guy, Pikachu is the dude. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. He's like the Mickey just, Mouse for cute. Pokemon. I mean, he's extremely cute. So cute. Not only that, but it's a really cool character and he's been in, in the mainstream for so long. Um, it's just a really like recognizable figure that means a lot to a lot of people. Yeah, absolutely. So whenever the movie Detective Pikachu came out, I will tell you that I was like, hey, Nikki, you're going to hate this idea, but we are going to watch this shit in theaters. Yeah, there's not a lot of movies that you're ever like, we have to go to the movie theater. Mm -hmm. I like going to the movie theater more than you do. Yes. And so when you were like, we have to go to the movie theater and watch this, I was like, dear God, what is it? Yeah. And then you told me and I was like, I'm not excited for it. And it was so cute. It was a great movie. It was I so really cute. enjoyed it. I don't know about Ryan Reynolds being the voice of Pikachu. I mean, who are you going to pick but it, then? It, it 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 was okay. Who, if not Ryan Reynolds, then who? I don't know, but not right? not Ryan Reynolds. I thought it worked just fine. It was okay, but it and still it one of those things because that just of, like irks me a little it bit. It fit because of the storyline. I felt like Ryan Reynolds fit just fine, and that the movie was way better than it had any business being. The following trailer is rated S for spoilers. Ah. Oh. Presented by Movies Anywhere. Your movies together at last. I thought that was Download the, the Movies Anywhere app mm -hmm. today and bring your movie collection together. You love Pokemon and yes. Ryan Reynolds. You definitely hate video game movies. And you <laughs> probably don't have a hot take on film noir. Now, Legendary will mush it all together and hope something clicks in Pokemon Detective Pikachu. Get ready, Poke so fans! Cute. After 21 animated movies, 22 seasons of TV, and countless video games, Pokemon is finally getting a live action film based on a weird spin off that no one bought outside Japan. <laughs> I'm sorry, but can we investigate your cloaks? But a mystery game for six-year-olds was probably the right choice to adapt, since every other Poka thing is a dogfighting simulator, a pay-to-win <laughs> card game, or a playable corpse finder. Oh, yeah, remember? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You guys want to go see a dead body? <laughs> what? <laughs> see all of your favorite Pokemon come to life on the big screen, like Charizard. Look, the, uh, hell. the tongue one. Mm. Or, ah, what is that thing? Ditto. Ah. But for those who don't know or care, grab a hold of Ryan Reynolds' Pikachu. I will electrocute you. A detective whose wisecracking charm could carry a premise as dumb as, well, Detective Pikachu. <laughs> because no matter how you feel about Pokemon, this is the closest we'll get to a new Deadpool for a while. Oh. I mean, come on. Just look at the little guy. Look at his little hat. Oh. Wait, what was I saying? Uh, yeah, the movie's all right. I mean, he's a Pikachu who's a detective. You get what you pay for. When you need someone to act scared of an animated lizard, you call Justice Smith. <laughs> Unravel the mystery of his missing dad, who, spoiler alert, is the character who sounds exactly like his dad. I forgot about That's that. Dopinner could have cracked this in like five seconds, but with the help of this girl from a completely different movie. But I don't fear fear. I walk the walk and I talk the talk and I'm willing to do whatever it takes to get the honest scoop and that's the hard truth. They'll uncover a businessman's secret plot to merge humans and Pokemon because movie? I mean, I get why he would want a Pokebody, but why would he bother to make all of humanity? Oh, there's my furry widow guy. <laughs> here's my Pika Pika. You don't have to make any sense at all, do you? No. In a franchise known for fighting, get only the tiniest glimpse of its potential. It then could thrill yeah. at action set pieces where our heroes run away from a Pokemon. Run away from a Pokemon. Run away from a Pokemon. Run away from this forest that's actually a Pokemon. And run away from a. Not for the games. Say it. Just say it. Pokemon. 
So get ready for a film that was a bit too dark for kids. Are you going to make me into a lampshade? And a bit too cutesy for adults. Ah. But nonetheless, <laughs> takes its rightful place as the third best hard-boiled detective story featuring cartoon animals ever. Hell yeah. Suck it, cool world. Starring Justice for Smith, Little, Yellow, Different, April O'Neil, <laughs> Howard the Duck, Sad Lieutenant, Sad. Or Call Rhyme City. <laughs> Honestly, this cat trailer doesn't look so bad. Gas monkey, that junkie monkey. Oh, those were so Whoa. creepy. <laughs> Joker did it. And when you need a British stage actor to class up disposable pop culture, you call Bill. There Knight. you go. <laughs> That's pretty good. What have you done? Who framed Ryan Reynolds? <laughs> <laughs> Who framed Ryan Reynolds? So for the sequel, how are they going to get Ryan Reynolds back inside the Pikachu? Or is it going to be the other way around? Ugh. Yeah, no, no, no. This episode was brought to you by <laughs> Movies Anywhere. You choose where to purchase <sighs> movies. We'll bring them together in one place. Movies Anywhere. Download the app today. Rubber baby buggy bumpers. What did you think? Um, pretty accurate. Yeah, yeah, I'm not going to lie. It was um it was on the nose with a lot of criticisms, but it it didn't really have a I mean, it wasn't like tearing it apart or anything. It was just kind of explaining like this is what it is. It, I, I mean, thought it was a good movie. Yeah. I thought it was fun. I'm not again, it's not one of those movies that I'm going to recommend for any kind of huge award yeah. other than the animation on the movie was good. so good. It looked very good. And I don't think it was too cutesy for adults. I mean, no. not for me anyway. No. I, thought it was, I mean, you know what you're going into. When, right, it's a Pokemon yeah, movie. Yeah, it's not like you're expecting, you know, something else. Yeah, but I do agree that they barely scratched the surface of what they could do with that. Yeah. Because, dude, there are so many badass storylines that have happened in the Pokemon anime and stuff that they could... Yeah. Translate into a live action movie that would just be wow. I would like to know how much money they spent. Oh my this movie. god, like untold amount, like amounts of money, I'm sure. Um, but a great video, honest trailers. I, I like what they do, yeah. and every time I've watched one of their videos, it's been pretty entertaining. Yeah. Uh, this was pretty spot on. Thank you guys for the recommendation. Yeah, thank you guys for the recommendation. And if you enjoyed this reaction, you know you could give us a like, subscribe to the channel, even give us recommendations for things you want to see us react to yes, in the future. Yes, you can do that in the Discord, on our Twitch, our Patreon, or down in the comments below. That's right. Thank you guys for checking this one out, and we will see, see you, you next guys. time.